Hi guys, so welcome back to my channel. I um, hope you guys are doing good. I hope um, that the videos I've been doing are somewhat helpful to some of you ladies. Um, I've just done a bit of a crazy haul from Superdrug and Boots because those are the closest kind of stores near me anyway that sell this kind of product. There's so many more products out for girls with curly hair and for me that's just like the best thing and I just I can't decide which products I want to try because I keep trying this one and I like that one and then I try another one and then I like that one and I try a different one there's just there's so much variety out there and um, so anyway so we're gonna jump straight into it I've got a box full of products that um, I'm gonna talk to you guys about there's no kind of order to it I'm just kind of gonna pick out whatever comes first and then I'll just talk about it a little bit tell you where I got it so here we go first product that I absolutely had to try so it is the sheer moisture strengthen and restore leave-in conditioner this is the Jamaican black castor oil my god this stuff right here this is literally the holy grail of leave-in conditioners for me anyways um, this is what the bottle looks like and honestly for styling, just put it in your hair. It makes your hair so soft. It um, it smells amazing. Like the smell, I can't get over the smell. It's absolutely fantastic. It's just, um, it's really really good for your hair. If your hair's really dry, damaged, one of the best things I would suggest using is this um, strengthen and restore leave-in conditioner. Honestly, that's the balm, dark calm. Okay, and I got this from Boots. Um, it was, I think it was either £11.99 or £12.99. It was no more than that. Um, and honestly, if the, of all the products that I've bought, this is my favourite. It's actually, it's empty. Like, I've literally run out because I use it so much. So this is top of my list to go on top of. The second product that I absolutely love and that I bought recently is still keeping within the sheer moisture brand is the sheer moisture coconut and hibiscus curl enhancing smoothie this is what it looks like it's all bright and orange and this stuff is just as amazing as the leave-in conditioner honestly it's so good for your curls i feel like when i use this on my curls they are on their best behavior it just gives them such good definition it's not too thin like the um like the leave-in conditioner because that one's quite runny so this one is good it's a little bit thicker and it gives it, your hair a little bit more hold um so yeah this is one of a really really good one to use it smells amazing it smells like it smells like candy to me i don't know maybe it smells different for other people but yeah this is amazing i love this stuff um i got this from boots as well um, and the only reason why I actually bought this was um, Sankis Alba, she tweeted, she, not she tweeted, she um, Instagrammed about this and she said how amazing it was and oh my god, I, I like idolise her, so <laughs> I went out and I bought it and I was not disappointed, so sheer moisture, this is a thumbs up for this one. The third thing that I got that sticks within the sheer moisture brand, I promise these are the brands here, <laughs> is the... Sheer Moisture Coconut Hibiscus Curl and Shine Shampoo. So this is basically just the shampoo to the um, to the curl enhancing smoothie, and this is what the bottle looks like. So it's thick and curly hair, which is me. <laughs> um, this is really really good. It's sulfate free and col and color safe. Um, it's got silk protein and neem oil, whatever that is, and obviously it smells just as good as the. Um, Curl enhancing smoothie. This is really, really good to buy. I mean, to me, sh kind of shampoos and stuff are not as important for me as the actual conditioners and leave-in conditioners that you you apply more in your hair. But um, yeah, this is really good and it smells amazing. And I've only got half half the bottle left. Um, but yeah, this is all all the um, sheer moisture stuff I bought from Boots, and they were all either twelve pounds or eleven pounds. Um, so yeah, they were pretty cheap. The next thing I bought was, um, I bought a few r different shampoos for my hair. Um, the next one I bought is the Palmer's. It's Palmer's Olive Oil Formula. 
um, cleansing conditioner co-wash the non lathering one so to be honest with you this caught my eye because of the color <laughs> it's very bright it's very very healthy um, this is what the bottle looks like it's got no sulfates and no parabens uh, and it's a co-wash so this has actually been a life saver for me um, I've been learning all about how to maintain your curly hair and what you should do and what you shouldn't do and how shampooing all the time is bad for your hair um, but co-washing is good because it obviously it leaves the moisture in your hair uh, so yeah I've been using this quite a lot um, I think I've, I've only used about a quarter of it so far but this um, yeah this is really really good and then your hair feels so darn soft at the end of it so good I love this I've actually got my mum onto this <laughs> so yeah this is good I got it from where did I get it from I got it from Superdrug and I think it was like $4.99 or $5.99 and they give you quite a good good size bottles maybe as big as my head so it will last you a really really long time staying within the palms range I then picked up another shampoo I don't know why I bought so many shampoos I think I was just trying to buy everything in pairs because that's just how weird I am everything's got to be like in pair <laughs> uh, the next thing I bought was the Palmer's sheer formula and this is the curl repair moisture shampoo okay this is what it looks like and it's got um, it says anti breakage elongates curls and redefines shine um, I do like this shampoo. I um, I think it's good, obviously, because it's got no parabens, no sulfate, no sulfate, sorry, no mineral oil, and no plaflates, whatever the heck it says. I can't see. Can you see that? No plaflates, whatever that is. Um, so obviously, on paper, it sounds amazing. It sounds like it's so good for your hair and has got none of those harmful products in there. Um, but I think the smell. There's just for something that's coconut and sheer moisture, I expected it to, not sheer moisture, sorry, and sheer, and got sheer butter in it, coconut butter. I honestly thought it was going to smell a little bit better. It doesn't smell bad, but, um, it's, yeah, it doesn't smell as amazing as the other ones that I've tried. So that's put me off a little bit, but it's, um, it's still a really good product. It was from Superdrug as well, and it cost me, um, I think it was $5.99. Um, so six pounds which is pretty cheap considering the size of the bottle that you get and it's really really easy to use because of the um you just press your the little cap down and it just comes out so that's quite nice to have i also got in the palmer's sheer formula i got the curl repair moisture conditioner okay this is what it looks like so it's the matching one to the shampoo and when I actually saw these two products in the shop, I didn't go in for these two products, I actually went in for a different product, which I'll show you in a minute. Um, and I saw these and I just saw curl repair, anti-breakage, elongates curls, redefines really shine, and then I saw obviously that it's quite, you know, it's really, really good your hair, for your hair because it's got none of those really bad um, chemicals and stuff in it. I thought, my God, I've hit the jackpot. I got so, so excited when I saw this stuff. Like, oh my god, I have to buy it. I've got to try this. Um, but yeah, I do like it. Um, it's it's a little bit thicker, it's a little bit pasty, um, kind of the, the texture of it. Um, the smell, I mean it's not a bad smell, but it just for me when you've got other products that smell amazing in your hair, and then you've got something that smells okay. Um, but I just wish it smelled just a little bit better or had a slightly stronger kind of fruity smell because I like to smell like fruit. Um, but yeah, this was really good. I used this recently. Um, it made my head actually made the curls fantastic. I don't really know about the redefined shine because it didn't really give my curls any shine. Um, but it works just fine as a conditioner. I think it is really good for your hair and this was also £5.99, £6. So you can't really go wrong with that. But yeah, it is a good product and I do like it. I've actually got like half. <laughs> I've got like less than half left. So I am using it. So it is good. Okay. Okay. The next product is, this is actually what I went into the shop for. And then I saw those and I was like, oh, I'm going to buy those instead. Um, because this product that I 
I'm going to show you now is still within the Palmer's range. This is actually a brand new product that they've just brought out. I think it was like two, three weeks ago now. Um, it is the Palmer's Manuka Formula. Uh, Manuka Flower Honey Nourishing Conditioner. Sorry, my ball's a little squeezed, squashed. So this is what it looks like. This is the bottle. Um, and it says... Um, it's got almond oil, cocoa butter and shea butter. Restore moisture and shine naturally. Obviously got none of the bad product. I personally love using honey uh, in my hair. So anything that's got honey in it, I am more inclined to use just because it just makes your hair so soft. Anyway, so I bought this. It, actually, this doesn't even rewind before I bought it. This sold out at least four times before I could get it. I was so upset. I went to two different super drugs. I went online like every like three or four days just to buy it so I could try it. Um, and yeah, it took me a while <laughs> to find it in stock, but I did get it. I've only used it once because I've literally got it like last week. Um, and yeah, I got it from super drug and it was, how much was this? I think it was five pounds something, five to six pounds. So it's quite similar to the um, curl repair ones. And it smells okay. It doesn't smell that great. But um, my hair loves it. I put it in my hair. My, my curls absolutely soaked it in. And they just loved, they just felt really, really soft and um, really bouncy. So definitely that is, um, that is a good one. And then the final Palmer's range. Um, product that um, I bought um, and this one to, was even more hassle to get hold of <laughs> uh, this is the Palmer's Manuka formula Manuka flower honey and it's the leave-in conditioner so this is what the little bottle looks like so there you go okay and it's got the little spray top and this one I this is the one that I actually really, really wanted to buy. Um, I'm such a sucker for leave-in conditioners. I have more leave-in conditioners than I have anything else in my house. Um, so yeah, this um, this is really, really nice. I absolutely love it. It took me forever to even find it, to purchase it, because obviously it's new and everybody's buying it to try it. Um, but my hair absolutely loves this. And um, you know, for those days when, you don't mean really not to do your hair or you're just going to shove it in a bun or you just want to refresh your curls this is really really good to use um it leaves, leaves your hair feeling really soft and it gives those curls back the bounce and yeah i do like it this was really really good um i've only used it once because again i only just got it but um i like it i like it so far and it's a, it's a good size bottle for leaving conditioner don't you think usually they come like really small leaving conditioners like really tiny so yeah this was about, I think this was the same price as the normal conditioner, if not a little bit cheaper. So maybe this was four something, five something, but um, definitely a lot cheaper than the um, sheer moisture range. I thought I wanted, I wanted to try the um, the Super Drug own brand stuff. Um, the reason why I say that is because I saw they had a few brands or a few products that were specifically for curly girls, and I was intrigued. The, Style Expertise Define Texturizing Curl Cream and it says it's for extra smooth frizz free curls that keep their shape. Okay, so this is just a plain blue bottle and this is what it looks like. So it's the curl cream and it's just, I don't know what the 05 stands for but okay. <laughs> and I've used this a few times, I think I've used it like three times now and I don't generally like to use gels in my hair. I find it dries my hair up quite a lot um, and just makes it a bit cakey. And it, when these dry, I just feel like it just clumps together too much and it's just too much hassle for me. So I don't really use any sort of gels at all in my hair. Um, but this one is a happy alternative. Um, I quite like it. It feels quite velvety on your hands when you use it, which is always good. 
on and yeah left my hands feeling really soft and moisturized and it was easy to apply to my hair my hair didn't like cake together or it didn't feel too heavy on my hair it actually felt really really nice so for their own brand I would actually use this again so yeah so that one I like I think it was I think this was three pounds maybe like 360 or 340 or something like that so that was really really good so I like that one and then the next one I bought, um, which I haven't actually used yet, so I don't know how this, if it works, whatever, but um, it's staying with the Superdrug own brand, the Style Expertise Defense, uh, defense range, and it's a protecting heat styling spray. So it's just a heat protectant basically, and this is what the bottle looks like, it's this thing, the blue theme, um, and then it's got like a really easy spray top. Um, I haven't actually tried it, so I don't know what it looks like, so I'm just going to like spray my hand. I'm not sure if it comes out. Ah, okay, it comes out quite wet. Oof. Wow, there's a lot of alcohol in there. <laughs> oh my god, it actually smells like um, hand sanitizer. A very lightly scented hand sanitizer, but that actually doesn't smell too bad. Um, so if you do like blow dry your hair or use a diffuser um, or even if you're going to straighten it um, obviously heat protectant is always always a good one to buy also it's super super cheap uh, super drug I think I paid two pounds something for this I might be wrong maybe three pounds two or three pounds um, which is good but actually smells all right the first spray really was really alcoholic <laughs> But, um, yeah, it smells good. Next thing I bought within the Style Expertise Super Drug range is the Smooth range, and it's the Taming Anti Frizz Serum. So it's a wee little bottle, and that's what it looks like. Okay, um, I have tried this once, and it was okay actually. I liked the, it was really soft in my hands, really velvety, uh, made my hair feel really nice, and I used it. So this was okay. I don't mind this one as an anti frizz serum. See, I usually would use this just after I finished putting in my conditioner and my leave-in conditioner, and just like as a as a last as the last thing I put on my hair, and just to kind of run my fingers through and then um, leave it at that. So I've got no complaints with this. So I'm quite happy with their own brand stuff. Um, sometimes getting the branded stuff isn't always the best option so if, it just depends on your budget as well the next thing I bought for the last thing I bought from the super drug um, own branded stuff is some hair serum and I got the hair therapy oil with coconut um, and it's specifically for dried hair and this is what the little bottle looks like um, I like this a lot actually it smells amazing and my hair just soaks it up my hair loves it for some reason um, I've bought this a few times this isn't my first time buying this one I've bought um, I've bought the hair therapy one with argan oil in it which is pretty much the same colored bottle um, I thought I'd try the one with coconut oil as well but yeah I love these these are really really good they smell so good and they just I don't know they're good it's a hair serum it's always going to be good for your hair um, it adds a lot of moisture to it and yeah the smell I mean you can't go wrong when the product smells good and finally the last one <laughs> so the last one I bought from oh sorry and just really really quickly I didn't actually tell you guys the price did I Clever clogs. Uh, this one was two pounds something. The anti frizz serum, and this one was all was I think a pound something, a pound or two pounds. The um, coconut um, serum, coconut oil serum. So yeah, pretty cheap, pretty cheap. And this one smells so good. Mm. The last product, the last product, the last product <laughs> um, is the smooth, the olive, the ORS olive oil. Smooth and easy edges with pecky, pecky, pecky oil. I don't know how to say it, but this is what it looks like. This stuff is actually fantastic. Oh my god. Um, I got it from Boots and I think it was three pounds. 
two or three pound. It wasn't it wasn't that expensive. They didn't sell it in the shop. Um, I found this online, and I was just like, oh, I'll try that. So yeah, one of the um, really really good products. It um, it smells oh, it smells the butter. This literally smells so good. Oh. It's amazing. <laughs> um, it's um, it's really really easy. Of all the um, of all the edging gels and pastes and whatnots that I've used, this one is my favourite. The reason why I say that, oopsies, I just threw it. <laughs> the reason why I say that is um, it's not too thick and not too sticky. If that makes any sense um, this is what it looks like inside and I feel like whenever I, when I apply it in my hair it's got a really smooth feel to it, really soft feel to it and it doesn't instantly dry it doesn't instantly stick and it's not it's not sticky oh my god it's not sticky um, so what I like you can apply on your on your edges or sometimes I actually apply it on the ends of my curls if I'm just trying to um, smooth them out a little bit and then I crunch it all up um, and do it that way but it's yeah it's really really nice it's not one of those that just sticks instantly and I mean it smells good it feels good when I put it on I like this one I like this one a lot actually I like a lot <laughs> um, so that's it guys those are the products that I have bought um, I have a lot more products that I do want to buy, that I do want to try, so I will keep you guys updated with how I get on with these products. My absolute favourite ones um, is this one and the Sheer Moisture range. Honestly, I love all of those. They just, they just get curls. They get it. <laughs> um, so yeah, so I hope you guys liked it. Um, I hope I didn't babble too much. <laughs> So yes, yeah, so let me know if you guys like this video, um, if it was insightful and knowledgeable to, um, to some of you, then that's great. Um, make sure you click subscribe to my videos because I will be uploading a lot more. Um, and also make sure you check me out on my Instagram and my Twitter accounts. And make sure you give me a little follow, I do update those quite frequently and also why don't you just go and check out my blog too? <laughs> um, there's a lot more posts on my blog and I probably yeah write a lot more in there than I would do videos and stuff. But yeah, check it out. The link is below. And yeah, thank you so much for watching guys and I will see you guys later. Bye.